Carbon is the fourth most abundant element in the universe and takes on a wide variety of forms called allotropes, including diamond and graphite. A team of scientists led by Stanford's Wendy Mao and including Carnegie's Dave Mao, who were father and daughter, has discovered a new form of carbon which is capable of withstanding extreme pressure stresses that were previously observed only in diamond. The experiment started with a form of carbon called glassy carbon, which combines desirable properties of glasses and ceramics with those of graphite. It was compressed to 400,000 times normal atmospheric pressure. The new form of carbon created under these conditions was capable of withstanding 1.3 million times normal atmospheric pressure in one direction, while confined under a pressure of 600,000 times atmospheric levels in other directions. No substance other than diamond has been observed to withstand this type of pressure stress, indicating that the new carbon allotrope must indeed be very strong. Unlike diamond and other crystalline forms of carbon, the structure of this new material is not organized in repeating atomic units. It is an amorphous material, meaning that its structure lacks the long-range order of crystals. It may have an advantage over diamond if its hardness turns out to be isotropic, that is, the same in all directions. Diamond's hardness depends on the orientation of the crystal. According to Russell Himley, director of Carnegie's Geophysical Laboratory, these findings open up possibilities for potential applications, including superhard anvils for high-pressure research, and could lead to new classes of ultra-dense and strong materials. The Carnegie Institution has had over 100 years of extraordinary discoveries. To continue this tradition, Carnegie scientists need your support. For more information about this and other cool science, visit our website at carnegiescience.edu. This is John Strom.